duplicating a page on your site. We'll go and head into Site Center. Now, when we duplicate a page on a site, it's normally, normally because we like the layout of that page, the graphics are in a similar position, uh, it uses the same layout. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the page that most closely resembles the page that I want to duplicate to set up for the creation of the new page. I then click on the duplicate page button at the top of the page and I'm going to rename the page. We're going to call this page Search Engine Performance. And I'm going to determine where I want that page to sit in my overall navigational structure or whether I want to actually make this page an orphan page. Now because I'm setting it up as a marketing campaign, I'm going to click on Orphan Page. I don't want this page to be visible to members visiting my website. I want it visible to specifically to people that I am emailing. Now we're going to determine where this page sits. Now because it's a new page that I've created, I'm going to have it sit after the last page of the site, uh, Orphan Pages, and I'm going to click Save. Now with this new page, you'll notice that it is not published yet. I can now go in with uh, knowing that the page is laid out as I like it and I can make the text adjustments, graphic adjustments, as I see fit. So if we go back to Site Center, we can now see the Search Engine Performance page, which is a duplicate of the Ascends 360 page.